Let's take a look at area. Now, first of all, don't confuse area and perimeter. Perimeter is the distance around the outside, whereas area is the bit in the middle. Now, the formula for the area of a square and for a rectangle is the length times the width. Now, if on a square you've only been given one side, don't worry because the other side is identical, isn't it? So the area of a square five by five is simply 25 and the unit is square centimeters, not centimeters. So for a rectangle that is 12 by seven, the area is gonna be 12 times seven, which is 84 square centimeters. Now the area of compound shapes are a bit tricky, trickier um, because there is no formula for an L shape. So what we're gonna do is turn it into lots of shapes that we know the simple formulae for. So here I'm gonna turn it into a rectangle A and a rectangle B. Sometimes you might be turning the shape into a, a rectangle and a triangle, uh, but this is nice and easy, a rectangle and a rectangle. So this rectangle is 12 times five, which is 60 square centimeters. But this rectangle is not 20 by four. It's four height, but 20 is all the way up to here. But we want this distance here. So if, if, the, if the shape is 20 wide, but this part here is five wide, then this is gonna be 20 take away five, which is 15. And four 15s are 60 as well. It's quite coincidental that these are the same. So the area of this shape is 60 plus 60, so 120 square centimeters. So with compound shapes, break it down into more manageable and easier shapes.